everybody and welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. So as you will have seen I've not posted on YouTube in quite some time. This is due to the fact that I just didn't have time to continue doing YouTube and me and Louis were going out pretty much every two weeks on a Sunday getting outfit pictures and everything and then Basically, at the back end of last year in November, I moved home. Um, my mum and dad put the house in the market and we went and moved house. So I still live at home with my mum and dad currently. So as you can see, I am in a different space and a different background. Sorry, I'm just playing with a coat hanger. <laughs> I feel like I always need something to fiddle with. <laughs> um, but yeah, as you can see, I'm in a different space. I am in my dressing room. If you have come over from my Instagram, you will have seen my dressing room already. But yeah, we have moved house and I got my bedroom done and I started doing reels and TikTok content, which meant a lot of my time was taken up by Instagram, TikTok, um, reels, just filming in general. And it just got really, really hard to keep up with everything basically. So I had to obviously drop one thing. So as you will have seen, I've not uploaded on YouTube for a while. However, it is something I want to come back to, which is why I'm doing this video. It's basically inspiration from me and Lucy have just been on a virgin voyage, which was absolutely like the best thing that we've ever done. It was the first time I have ever been in a nightclub because they have a nightclub on board the ship. And yeah, it was just unreal. Um, but yeah, we went with Demi and Sean. It was obviously an ad trip, like a gifted trip and basically Sean and Demi were on our virgin cruise dates because I knew that she was going on them dates so we was like shall we try and go on the same one if we can and that is what we did so we ended up on the same ship, same cruise. Yeah we had a lot of fun with Demi and Sean and she is a YouTuber, she makes YouTube content mainly. She does do Instagram as well um, but she was like vlogging the trip and Louis was just a bit like, you should be doing this, why did you stop doing YouTube? Like, pick it back up again, start doing it again, like, wake up and vlog it. And then I was like, well, I'm one of them people where I have never vlogged in public. I don't vlog because I still work full time and my weekends are basically dedicated to Instagram content. So I think me and Louis have tried to come up with some sort of, maybe we'll do something on a Friday evening and on a Saturday or just do it on a Saturday and sometimes a Sunday. It just depends, like we're going to have to try and work it out where I'm still obviously getting the content that I need and for all platforms and maybe we will start vlogging. Like say if we do go to like Cheshire Oaks or something because we do obviously go on days out and yeah, it just depends because Lewis is at football quite a lot now, season started back up. Um, he's a season ticket holder. <laughs> unfortunately. Thank God golf is coming to an end but as soon as one ends one starts up again. <laughs> um, but yeah me and Lisa have been sat watching Demi and Sean's vlogs and we were basically like oh wouldn't it have been really good if we like we vlogged it basically. Um, so yeah she's we've been, I was sat there with her and she basically gave me a life lecture on how I should start YouTube again and all this that and the other and she was like really helpful and yeah it was just like a like a friend conversation if you will um, on how to do well and stuff because obviously it is her full time job. So basically yeah that's where my inspiration has come from all thanks to Demi. I had quite a lot of you like quite a lot of people on Instagram especially have asked me to come back and I've been like oh, I just don't have the time. So here you are everybody this is like your lucky lucky week. <laughs> I am coming back to YouTube so Please do leave some comments on what videos you want to see from my channel. Um, I do have a haul coming up from White Fox Boutique, so that will be going live shortly. And obviously in the house move, we have gone to a bit of a bigger house. So I have two rooms now, I have a dressing room and a bedroom. If you've come from Instagram, you might have already seen them. Please do let me know if you would like to see a room tour of them both and um, we go through like where my furniture's from, what other bits I have and just, just like stuff like that. Um, I know people can be quite nosy like me and obviously it gives people inspiration as well on what they want in their dressing room or space of choice. 
Um, but yeah, let me know if that is something you want to see. Also, what other videos you would like me to post. Um, but yeah, I feel like it has been a long time coming. Like, me and Lewis, I have taken my camera on different trips that me and Lewis have done. And I've been like, oh, like I'm too nervous to pick up the camera and vlog because I just feel like people will laugh at me or like Lewis will laugh at me. And I'm one of them people where I'm quite shy like that. Like in school, people would make fun of me and it's just one of them things that like is embedded in me now where I feel like I don't have the confidence to do much. Like, kind of like have attention on me basically, where it's easy to sit here with a camera in my own room, on my own, and film a YouTube video because there's nobody here. <laughs> um, even when I did YouTube before stopping, I would like shut all my doors, be like, Mum, shut the downstairs door, like, you can't hear me, blah, blah, blah. Um, but I feel like I just need to get over that fear. I have started doing talking stories on Instagram, which took me a while because again, that was like another fear, if you will, because I have a lot more followers on there and I thought people would make fun of me, but I feel like I just need to get over that. I'm 25 years of age, I need to grow up. <laughs> um, but yeah, I feel like even if me and Louise were to do vlogs every so often, I could still do YouTube like content, but it just depends what you don't want to see. Um, yeah, we've been on quite a few holidays as well, which would have been nice to vlog, but obviously I wasn't doing YouTube. I do have all my Instagram story highlights that everybody can see on my page. Um, but yeah, I just feel like I don't really know what else to say because I've, I've just filmed this, right, and basically my camera cut out because it got too hot and it just completely put me off my tracks of like thought and what I wanted to say. But yeah, if you are new watching, then hello, welcome. And if you are a previous watcher and you're coming back and you're excited for my YouTube channel, then let me know in the comments as well because I feel like I'm pretty nervous about it, but also at the same time I'm not. Um, it just takes up a lot of time, like editing and exporting, uploading to YouTube and everything like that because obviously I've got Instagram and TikTok and bits and bobs to maintain as well and people don't really see the ins and outs of it like I could be sat I think I've been sat here for like nearly an hour now filming both videos because I'm redoing this one and then I'm gonna have to go and edit and upload and everything like that so I haven't done that in a long while so I'm hoping fingers crossed that it, it, it runs smoothly and it's okay because I feel like my laptop's got quite old now I do have a MacBook and when did I get it I think I must have had it about almost three years maybe if not longer so I'm hoping it's okay. I do use it still, um, but not often. I just use it to watch YouTube if I need to. Um, but yeah, if you are excited, then let me know in the comments. Let me know as well what other videos you want to see. And yeah, me and Lisa are going to try and vlog. Maybe I can try and convince him to go out today and we can make one, but I really don't know what. <laughs> like I don't want to post about it on my Instagram yet because I want to be like, surprise everybody. <laughs> But yeah, I think next week I might try and do like a QA. and a um, I'll put a question box on my Instagram stories next weekend. Or even if you want to leave comments down below in the questions, then feel free to. And I'll try and remember to come back and answer some. But yeah, I'm sat here playing with a coat hanger because it stops me fiddling with my necklace and everything like that. Because I am a bit of a fiddler. But yeah. Like I've said, let me know what you want to see in the comments and I hope you are all excited to have me back on YouTube. I feel like I am really excited but also a bit nervous because I don't even know. I just feel like... But to be honest, it gives me more chance to talk shite about nothing and nobody's interested. But hey ho, that's YouTube isn't it? We're all nosy and that's why we watch other people's lives on YouTube. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I will see you for another video shortly and fingers crossed that I keep them up and yeah, maybe we can build a YouTube community on my channel and keep uploading.